Hey, Jack, thanks for writing. I'm just uh, getting to your email now. So, so there are a number of paths that we can go on depending on how comfortable you are with your right and left hand. In general, you, you should be practicing your making of major chords, of minor chords on both hands, right? So if I say, can you play a D major? I want your hand to go to the D and find the major. Can you make a rhythm with it? Sure. Right, and then switching between chords. Th that should be a given regardless of whether you want to play Irish music or klezmer or French music. Th that's going to be common. It's learning the alphabet of music. Good. Now, if we take a tune, the, the only tune that I know is when Irish eyes are smiling. I've heard it before. I'll link you to a blog post about how to learn a song. And I assume that you know these songs. You know when Irish eyes are smiling. When Irish eyes are smiling, I'm assuming that you can pick up the words and kind of sing the song. Da, 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 da. So how do we go about learning it? If you have sheet music, wonderful. You can find sheet music all over the place. I don't have these specific songs on Accordion Love. But there are lots of places for sheet music. In general, follow those steps. We know how to sing the song. We have the sheet music. And the only reason we're using the sheet music is we want to follow along with the chords. What I'm going to do is if my chords are C major to G major to C major, which you know how to do. C major to G major to C major. What we're going to do is we're going to follow along the song. I'm not even going to play the song. I'm just going to play the left hand. When Irish eyes are smiling. And then it goes to an F, let's say. We're going to read the sheet music. Da, 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 da. Good. And that's... Now, this might be way too beginner for you, in which case... Let me know and I can go into more details. But in general, we'll, we're following the song while singing or humming, right? Not even a rhythm. Da 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 And we're already there. We're almost singing the song. Next step would be to do a rhythm. I think when Irish eyes are smiling is a waltz. And so we open up with a waltz rhythm just a waltz in a C major. And because you know the song, I want you to be able to hum or sing along with the song in rhythm. Start the rhythm. When Irish switch, eyes are smiling. Do, 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 da, 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 switch. And again, what we're doing is we're breaking down the song into its chords so that you understand when to switch chords. What are the chords of the song? C major, G major, C major, F major. Whatever the sheet music may tell you. Which means that in your 15 minutes of practice every day, you should be able to switch flawlessly, musically, between C major, G major, and F major. And what we could say is... So there are a few more chords in When Irish Eyes Are Smiling. Learn how to move between those chords. Now, what do we do with our right hand? We, we do the exact same thing that we did with our left hand on our right hand, C major. When Irish eyes are smiling, do, 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 da, 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 da. I'm playing the chords. So your 15 minutes of practice is, do you know your C major and its voicings? Do you know your F major and its voicings? And your G major and its voicings? And switch between them with minimal movement because the melody of the song will be within those chords. That was just C major. That was E, C, and G as kind of dominant in the melody. So I'll, I'll leave you there. If this is too basic, let me know. And I could, I could work on, I could work with you more specifically on these songs. But in general, that's how I approach learning a song. Do you know the song? Can you hum it in your head? 
what are its chords and can you switch those chords and rhythm while humming and then very slowly we introduce our melody over the right hand but in general unless you could do this do 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 your playing will never sound smooth and musical, which is, I, I think, part of what we're trying to do. Good. Let me know if you have any questions, Jack. I'm happy, obviously, to, to, to do this video exchange. Thank you.